People living in Northern California will be waking up to more rain and more snow this morning. Drivers on Interstate 80 near the California Nevada border last night got a white Christmas and a, yeah, somewhat of a traffic jam. Road crews had to shut it down because of hazardous conditions, and it happened several times. The delays, of course, were up to two hours. Caltrans says low visibility caused several accidents, but even so, people took time to pull over and there we go. Yeah, Have a little fun. Got on the saucer. Yeah, make the best of it. Exactly right. Of the snow. All right. Well, we're seeing snow here in our mountains. Colin Jackson right. joining us with your current cast 23 weather and traffic together. Yeah. We have open roads, no problems there. We've checked the highways. You do need chains going into Tahoe still, but the big delays are over. Just got off the phone with the China Peak snow line. They've got 13 inches of fresh powder on the ground. Badger Pass is open. Nothing for Alta Sierra yet, but it's, uh, you know, just coming down lightly in this area. Oh boy, what a season it's been. The rain and the snow in the mountains, the Sierra is ready to go. Here's Lake Isabella. Light flurries reported there, also snowing in the Tehachapi area, and a few flurries at Fraser Park, but there's not a lot of rain behind the system that's coming through, so it's tapering off as we speak. We still have the winter weather advisory, though, till 4. 68 inches of snow is possible, about 5,000 feet, and right now it's kind of a chilly 45. Winds are southeast at 7 as the city wakes up to return all those items you don't want. 37 in Tehachapi, 45 in Porterville, and we've got low 40s in Wasco as well. So the cold air will funnel all in today, and we'll have highs, you know, in the low 50s at best. That's below average. And currently, this is how it looks it's 39 in Paso Robles, 50 down in Burbank. And we're at 45 and Fresno's at 46. Future radar kicks everything out of here rather quickly by the end of the day. Then we taper off and dry out for the rest of the week. And we have a nice weekend on tap, too. Winds, though, gusty in the mountains and deserts at around 30 miles per hour from the west northwest. And those winds will be with us all throughout the day today. These are the numbers and these are the conditions for today expected. Tahoe, 28 in snow. And 53 for San Francisco. Rain on and off, but not heavy. Down south, temperatures will be in the mid-50s along the coast with kind of a cloudy, gloomy day. Drive carefully over the grapevine. But again, everything's open. The roads are fine. 57 in Anaheim, 58 for Santa Monica with on and off showers. Our area, highs around 50. West winds at 15 to 20 miles per hour at times. Not all day, but you'll have those occasional gusts. And also in the mountain communities, we've got Lake Isabella coming in with a 46. And Tehachapi will only yank it up to the upper 30s with the light snow on the ground. Kind of fun for the kids, especially if you got a new sled for Christmas. Isn't that nice? 50 in California City, and we'll have mid-50s in Ridgecrest out east. Air quality's good. Seven-day numbers look like this. We stay cool for this time of year. Highs tomorrow, maybe only in the upper 40s. So cold air's coming on in, but the rainfall chances dwindle as we get deeper into the afternoon. Drive carefully, please. Back to you.